back to my channel. If you're new, please do feel free, subscribe, hit the notification bell, like this video. And if you've been here before, thank you for coming back. I love you guys so much. So as you can tell by the title, I will be doing another review. So, so the review that I'll be doing is on a foundation. For a foundation? Yeah, so maybe. But anyway, it is this new foundation. Let's see. Focus. Focus. Okay, whatever. But anyway, it is the Sphera or Povera. Whatever the name is. But anyway, you get what I'm saying. But yeah, it's this new foundation. I've been seeing it on Instagram, on YouTube. So I'm like, hey. Hi. And I found it online. So I'm like, let me just test it out because. Especially here in Cyprus, it is kind of difficult finding your own foundation and you have to mix and match or you have to come with it from home. So, I want to see how this will work out. So if you can, then you can get it online. And if it's actually quite good, I'll put it on my shop. I'll link the shop website. <laughs> anyway, so it comes in this box. It's actually kind of, it looks, it looks small, but it's 30 mil, so hey. But yeah, it comes in this. It says it's soft matte, long wear, liquid foundation, and it says that it is full coverage. I got it in the color number 109, which is Mocha. Hopefully that's my shade. It was one of the darkest shades, if I'm not mistaken, but yeah. Unfortunately, they don't have any darker than this. And lucky for me, it is kind of getting hot and the sun is out. So look at, I'm not sure if you can see it perfectly on camera, but Look at this. Okay, yeah, it's not as clear on camera because I also have the light on. But yeah, this and this is not the same. So, the struggle is real. But anyway, so then it cuts this small. Yeah, it has a pump, but I'm not going to use the pump because I feel like... <laughs> I know this is kind of bougie, but I feel like it's going to get dirty because it's white and I don't like dirt like that. So I'll just open it up. So, Silky, so this looks like I could just lick it. It looks good. But we're not here for the looks, we're here for the tasting. So let me just go on and put on my pineapple um, primer. I've already washed my face, I've moisturized, and yes, my hands are clean, so chill. This thing is so soft. Another pump. And yeah, I already did my brows off camera because, hey, let's try to do a full look and then see how well this thing holds up. So, let me just. Test it out. What am I gonna use? Beauty blender or brush? Let me use a brush because that's pretty much what I always use. And then I'll go over with it with the beauty blender. So I'll just use my hand. Okay, yeah, it kind of does match my skin, I think. Okay. Sorry for not looking into the camera. It, I'm using. It as a mirror because I don't have a mirror. I don't have a small mirror, guys. Am I the only one? Well, actually, I do. Yeah, I do. But like, it's for like a foundation. Um, foundation. I should have palette thing. Anyway, let's move on. We not talk too much. I do have some spots and I don't wanna like use a orange concealer over them. Let's see how this actually covers up. It's not like terrible spots, but they're they. They are they. Hmm. 
Ooh, your cooking moment, maybe. <laughs> I have corners in me this week. And it's not too much, but it has like a little reddish orangey undertone to it. Because I kind of look up close though, but like this, it looks okay. Hmm. How many pumps did I use? Not pumps actually, I can't use dabs. So it could be like a pump and a half maybe. Okay, it actually covers up well because. As you could see, I had like some spots here. Uh, usually, I have I have some here. It's kind of cover, yeah. I wouldn't say full full coverage, but actually good. I think, yeah. Kind of looks. It's very light. That's one thing I can say. It doesn't really feel like I have foundation on. To be honest, it just feels skin. I'll spoil like this. I'm kidding, but yeah, it feels very light, so that's good. They did say light way, right? Long way, but it is light. And um, what else? Yeah, it feels good. It feels really nice and smooth on the skin because some foundations feel really heavy, like you know you have makeup on, like it feels like you have a cake on your face. But this is quite, it's quite light. I think I like it. But we'll see how well it holds up. I was gonna go over it with the beauty blender, but there's no streaks from my brush. Use a good kabuki brush, guys, but yeah. That's fine. Yeah. Anyway, we'll see. Let me finish up with my makeup and then we'll see how long this goes. So, guys, I went ahead and did uh, my full makeup. But yeah, enjoy this video of me looking good. <laughs> But yeah, I'll show you how it lasted on my next video. And if you want to see this look, then watch my next video. Thank you.